Finally, finally, we have returned to the scenic pond. Well, not yet. I haven't clicked yet. I'm gonna assume that there was a previous level called the scenic pond. Some... I don't know. The return of the king doesn't have, like, uh, the king before it. As in a movie titled The King. Well... And as always, my brain goes to but this isn't the, the rings. But this isn't the return of the scenic pond. This is the return of scenic pond, which is title. Well, all right, right then. All right then. You probably have a point. Let's have a look. Because if otherwise it's like the return of the bride of Chucky. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, I remember this one. I even remember my brother struggling with this one when we made him play the game over Christmas. Oh my god, yeah, this one already had two different versions, as it was. So this is a third version of Scenic Pond. Wouldn't it be fucky if it was just the same level again and we forgot how to solve it, so we can't <laughs> do it? Because it kind of looks exactly the same. It kind of looks exactly the same. Text is defeat? Text is defeat. That part is new, I think. Maybe. All right, well, what's, what are we gonna do here? I don't see the right level, so we really just straight up need to win, she said. Flag is win, is what we need. Skull is sink. But skull has wall. So if you push something into the skull, it will turn into a piece of wall. Um, so we really need to we make can, Baba float. Well, we can't get a piece of text in there. What we would like to do is like Baba has Keke, then you could create a Keke. The problem is that Keke is not you. Okay, so there was this thing where... You can write text has Keke. Yeah. And then you can push a piece of text into uh, the water, right? Yeah. And, and then that water would become a keke. No, this won't help. Yeah, yeah. okay. Here's, here's, here's my idea, okay? Yeah? Uh, no, no, first we have to push the uh, Baba is you a bit to the right because it's currently in the way. Because we want to push stuff up into the water but the, the, the string Baba is you is in the way. Yeah. So the string Baba is you has to go a bit to the right. Okay, this is fine. Now, if you write text has keke like this, uh, vertically, and then push it up into the water, not sure you're at the right row. No. So if you do this and push it up, then the word text will become a keke. Now we can write keke is you. Boom. Ah. No. Now we have to go down. And then Keke has Baba. Now we can write Keke has Baba. No, Baba has Keke. No. So here's a problem. We can write Baba has Keke, but cannot write um, both being you at the same time. Right? That's a problem. Hmm. hmm. It's like we're missing a word. We're missing a piece of text. Because we need something to walk in there to become... to, to, to destroy the word. But we, can, we cannot get a piece of text in there. Okay, 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 okay. I actually think that we, this is like, not... We could put I the think, word... Let me, let me try something, okay? Sure, sure, absolutely. Text has... Okay. Okay.
No. Oh, shit. So I'm thinking, like, what if we could, like, create a keke, and then we can write... No, we can't. Like, Baba is keke. I mean, keke is Baba, and then we'd have, like, two Babas. We can't do that. Hmm. No. Damn. No, that's not gonna work. Hmm. I hope we're not super overthinking this. We might be, okay. I was thinking somehow Keke is float. Um But that's not gonna help. I'm not I'm, I don't see how we get a piece of text in there. The only way to do it is to get a Baba or a Keke in there and they have like the word say for example Baba has text. Uh, then the Baba would walk into the water and become the word Baba. But but the problem is then we're dead. Right? Let's see. That looks like Baba's float, Baba's you, Baba's text. Okay. Hmm. Baba has text. We can write text has Baba. Uh, does that help? Oh yeah! If we write text has Baba and we push the word Keke into the water, yeah. then we get two Babas and then we don't need the word Keke. You can just push, yeah, exactly. Like that. Now, if we write Baba has text. Yep. Uh oh. Ah. Um. Oh no. Hmm. Tricky. Very tricky. Okay, fine. I mean, you can get out with the Baba first, yeah. Yeah, that's what I was like. Can't All right. Remember. Baba has text. Now we can walk uh, with one Baba in there and create the word Baba. Yeah. Ba Baba is float. Yeah. So okay. Baba is float. I can float over this. Yeah. Skull is sink. That's fine. Flag is win. And that should be it, right? I am float. Oh, shit. Oh, that's a problem. Um, Text is defeat. Um, text is you? Text is defeat. Oh, text is defeat. Um, <laughs> we could... Okay, fine. No, 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 I th oh, yeah, okay, maybe... Um, I was thinking, can I make something else win? Not Baba, but... I don't think so. I mean, how? Text is... Not text is win, because text is defeat. And text is push, so you can't, like... Hmm... Mm -hmm. Hmm. Well. Um. Has text. <sighs> okay. I have an idea. You have an idea? Mm -hmm. I do. Hmm. 
However, my text, uh, my idea isn't gonna work. Why not? Because the string above, I assume, needs to be further up. Oh, which is not possible. Oh. Um. If I create a second Baba, again, I can break this string. But, okay, so we need to create more than one Baba. Mm -hmm. Is that possible? Probably have to go back to the beginning for that. If I'm on the right track, which I might not be. Um, so we said text has text has Baba, I know. Um, and then we use the word keke to create a second Baba. Okay. Can I? Oops. Um I have a, a question. Mhm. Mm what happens if you because now text is defeat, right? Right? Yeah. So, if Baba is next to a wall, and you push a piece of text into Baba, what happens? You can use one of the Babas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that breaks it. The um, Baba. But yeah, exactly. Else. Um, what happens... What happens if you do this while Baba has text. Or while text has Baba. While text has Baba. But I'm not breaking... Um... No, th for this to work, you'd have to like create the string text has Baba with the push. Okay, but also, I'm not destroying the text, I'm destroying the Baba, so really, it has to be Baba has text. Okay, but this is, uh, this is bad, since we're on- I know it's bad, but let's just, that's what you wanted to do, right? Yeah. I'm okay. not, I'm not actually, um- So the opposite then, this, yeah. ba Baba has text. Um Okay. I have double Baba text. Baba text. It says Baba has Baba text. Oh, Baba has Baba. That's great. Baba has Baba and text. Whoa. All right. Wait. Wait. So what happens if you walk into that water? Um, text is float and Baba's float. Just Baba's float. So yeah, no. Baba was destroyed, but then you created the word Baba and the Baba. And now Baba is float, so... Can we use this... Can we use this, this to create more Babas? Because every time we break something now, we create two things. That's powerful. That has to be powerful. Okay, I have an idea, by the way. No, that creates a work. wall. Okay, but like, for real though. Can we do this another way? We have to go back. 
No, you create their wall. Now we can't get out. Uh, okay. I was thinking power swing, yeah? So obviously getting the word stuck here uh, to the to the left is probably not good. Can we do this on the right side? So, like if we use the fence, can we do this in a way where we don't trap ourselves with the words? Is what I'm wondering. Let's see. Yeah, something like that. Because then we can still get the words out. Okay, so you gotta push the word text into the Baba. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, but I mean, I'm still... Oh no, wait, I can get that out. So, yeah. Baba, so that means I can write Baba text with you, but that doesn't actually help me because text is defeat. Correct. But we can... We can just write the same thing as before. We can write uh, Baba has Baba text. Yeah. And now we can walk into the water down there to create the Baba's float, just like before. It's just that now we can still manipulate the words. Great. Now the question is, do we want to do this? No. Um, can... Okay, let's stop. Let's stop and survey. Can we use this uh, scenario we're in to create more Babas? Baba walks into water. That creates a Baba. And, of a baba. and the word Baba. Mm -hmm. um, yes. Do that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now go down. And what happens if you now switch it up? So you write uh, text Baba has Baba. Just switch the has and the, the Baba text. Put them on top instead of on the bottom. Because now you're writing text has Baba. Mm -hmm. So now we push the word Baba into the water. Ah, two Babas. Aha, yes. I was, I was just confused by you saying Baba text. Sorry, I meant text Baba. <laughs> Baba has... Now I need it the other way around, and then I need to switch it again. Yeah. We can technically create as many as, like, six or seven babas. Yes, but I... We're not gonna need six or seven babas. And I don't wanna, like, just get, make myself even more confused. All right. Okay. Babas float. That means I can... Oops, I can do the thing. You can do the thing. Flag is win. Now I can do the oh, yeah. thing that I want. We remember do. this from before, for ah. how how to break uh, the float. Yeah. Ugh. Okay. The Just one. gotta get both of them in there, okay. and at the same. Eh. Uh. No, this is yeah. This no. What? What? Okay. That's the best way I could think of to get them both in here. Just go left. Ah, all right, that works. So now down and up. Ah. There you go. Baba is no longer float. I won! Well, that was a recap of a lot of like just mechanics from previous ones. So that opened up a path back. That's good.